Scorpio, welcome back. This is going to be a December 30 and 31 reading for Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in the North Node for Scorpio. December 30 and 31 for Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in the North Node for Scorpio. What is the message is here for Scorpio? December 30 and 31. Let's get an overall energy right here. For Scorpio, December 30 and 31. Okay, yeah, we have make a move, okay? And then memories, okay? So I'm gonna, gonna take one, but I saw make a move first. It says the time is now. Someone is planning to take action or it's time for you to make the move. So if you've been wanting to move towards somebody, date somebody, reach out to somebody, talk to somebody, Scorpio, now's the time. It says memory. Someone is walking down memory lane at this time. It's okay to reminisce about the past by looking at old photos or messages. So somebody could, yeah, magnetic souls. Okay, so you feel a magnetic pull to soar towards someone from your past. You could be looking at their photos, going down memory lane, thinking about them. And this is how somebody feels about you, Scorpio. Okay, it says your sacred souls are instantly drawn towards each other. Because this is the sacred union between two people. That's why you're, you're, you're feeling this way or whatever the fuck. Okay, um, yeah, period. Let's see. All right, let's see. What's the messages for Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in the North Node, December 30 and 31 for Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in the North Node, December 30 and 31 for Scorpio. What, what is this make a move energy and magnetic soul in down memory lane? What is this make a move now energy for Scorpio? December 30 and 31. Yeah, the Six of Cups, again, that's that down memory lanes, that's pictures, that's being nostalgic. So I'm getting, you're really thinking about the past, looking at somebody's pictures, maybe looking at text messages that was sent, or whatever the fuck. Photos or whatever, okay? All right, so I'm definitely getting somebody's like looking at old photos, old messages, okay, of a person, really, you know, you know thinking about them. Yeah, the Six of Pentacles and the um, Will of Fortune. Yeah, this could be somebody from the past, yeah, that you have not spoken to or there's been no movement. But it's saying Knight of Pentacles is, is, is still, that's even, the Knight of Pentacles is immobile, okay? But I feel like you need to move. It says the time is now. You need to move. Or if you want to reconcile and give this person something, then you need to do that. Or this could be something about child support. Yeah, we have the Will of Fortune, the Devil, the Five of Wands. So where somebody was very hateful, nasty, envious, maybe they're shifting that energy or, do, or doing whatever this is that they were doing. Maybe they are, or a Capricorn, maybe someone's shifting their energy now. Or you're freeing yourself from this toxic person, this Capricorn. You have the Temperance, Six of Wands, Nine of Cups, Two of Cups. I mean, Nine of Cups, Page of Cups, and Knight of Cups. So I feel like there's an apology here that you want to give to somebody. But I feel like somebody is, is intervening or somebody's keeping you from doing that or telling you not to. Or this is you. Let's see. What is this? Make a move in magnetic souls energy. Yeah, the Ten of Cups in the chariot. So the chariot is moving. The Knight of Pentacles is here, but the chariot is movement. That's courage. That's 333. So that's confirmation. Fast forward moving energy. Okay, so I'm getting, it could be a cancer, but I'm getting Ten of Cups. Yeah, you're going from the Six to the Ten of Cups. So something, you're letting, yeah, the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, the judgment. I feel like you're being called to give somebody something, give somebody something, reach out, offer this, or do something like that. Yeah, the Eight of Cups in the world because I'm getting, you've gotten confirmation that you need to close a cycle out and walk away from it, Scorpio. You know that shit. I feel like you want to give somebody something or give somebody money or you want to give somebody because there's a magnetic pull here, a sacred bond. You feel a pull towards somebody and you cannot resist it. Yeah, the will of fortune. Yeah, there's been a shift. You're letting go of the, the, the toxicity, the toxic people, the jealousy, the hate, the envy, the behind the scenes, the competition. We're going into 2023. Life is short, my nigga. We, we're people dying left and right and not even knowing this they last year here on this earth. Make decisions that's good for you. Change and be a better person, dog. If somebody's telling you don't do that or... Don't give them child, because uh, I, I don't know what this is about a child or child support, whatever. Don't give them nothing or don't go towards them or don't whatever. That, or it could be a Capricorn or a Cancer telling you this or something. You need to, okay, man, you need to stand on your fucking own, man. Yeah, the Justice, Libra, and the Six of Swords. Yeah, the Two of Swords, Libra again, the Six of Pentacles, yeah. 
or whatever the fuck this is, dog. You need to you need to stand you need to stand on your fucking nose. Somebody don't have the best interest. Yeah, the five of swords and the justice. Yeah. So I'm getting this Libra is getting the last laugh. So if you're trying to yeah, get six of swords, two of swords, if you're trying to play a Libra or take something from them or do something grimy, bitch, they're going to get the last laugh, especially if it's in a court situation or whatever the fuck that is. They rule contracts, courts, lawyers and judges, police, all that shit. OK, because I feel like with that five of swords, somebody trying to do something fucking grimy. The five of swords is hateful, nasty, grimy, and it's for no fucking reason. It's the energy that I'm feeling. It's for no fucking reason. Yeah. Or whatever the fuck this is. Okay. Yeah. The her, yeah, the higher font, Taurus energy, three of wands and three of pentacles with the three of swords. So again, three, three, three showed up on my clock and here it is again. So three, three, three could be very, very significant for somebody here. That's the angels. That's something balanced. That's something coming in. Something your angels are guiding you. Yeah. You need to block this water sign. I keep getting that with, with in, in a certain reading. So you, the readings that I'm getting it in, you can have that sign, have the aspect, the heavy Taurus energy is what I get this reading in a water sign a cancer a scorpio or a pisces that needs to be blocked or you're breaking up with you're going down a different path you just know that you need to or you know you need to get away from this person or whatever the fuck this is i'm getting i'm getting you're, you're coming out of silence or you're coming out if, if something was ghosted or something wasn't moving i'm getting you're going to move now what's the higher fun in the reverse because there could have been yeah this could be a libra yeah the six of swords and the justice that you're going towards or or yeah the temperance that you want to make peace with or heal something with You've been in hiding or you've been away from this person or there's been no communication maybe for years with the Knight of Pentacles. But I'm getting I'm getting you want to move things into karma waters or you want to or you want to balance something out or something. Yeah, the two of swords is here. Yeah, this could be this could be whatever this is. All right. Yeah, the high priestess. Yeah, this could be this could be, your intuition is guiding you, Scorpio. Towards a Libra or a Sagittarius or a psychic or an occultist or a spiritualist or whatever the fuck this is. Okay, or maybe you need somebody's guidance or support or help. But I feel like, okay. I just feel like several people, yeah, this is an occultist. Yeah, somebody's a master one too. With the magician and the high priestess, they're a beast. And that's on God. Oh, you understand me? And they're guided, temperate, six of swords. Somebody is an earth angel, but they're powerful. OK, this is some yeah, the sun card. This is somebody that heals poverty, infertility and in people, um, their mind just by touching them, being in their presence, hearing their voice. Somebody is gifted, my nigga. That's why I keep seeing these sixes. Yeah, six of one cups, six of swords. And I saw the six of pentacles. Somebody is gifted. They were born to do this. And I feel like there's there's people keeping you from talking or or maybe going into peaceful waters with this person or something. You but, but but you're being guided to do that or to let go of this hate and envy and hateful shit you've been doing because I feel like somebody is suffering behind whatever they try to do to this Libra or somebody hates the justice or somebody hates that somebody keeps getting justice. Or somebody, but, but bitch, everybody hates the justice system, but everybody wants things to be fair and balanced. Well, bitch, how you expect that if you're if you're trying to go up against the law, ho? Okay, Libra's write the, the karmic laws and, and all laws, Libra's write them. They, they rule contracts, laws, and everything. Something, uh, instead of going against somebody, Scorpio, or this is them with you, you need to be trying to be make amends and if you're going towards somebody with hate in your heart trying to obstruct them or, or destroy them you're going to pay for that my nigga bad and if you already been doing it you already have been paying for it they know you have yeah the queen of swords a libra somebody's intelligent they're skilled and they're the best at what they fucking do somebody is a beast and that's just what it is yeah the will of fortune this is somebody's destiny yeah the six of wands somebody could be very popular here OK, in the public eye. Yeah, there's there seems to be some jealousy or hate or envy here or a lot of people intervening or, or doing shit behind the scenes to to cause disruption and 
and shit like that between you and somebody else. Somebody has done this. If you if you if you were around this person at once and, 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 and then that shit ended all of a sudden, you have somebody doing this shit behind the fucking scenes, dog. Keeping you two apart, keeping you from being on calm waters with this person. Or maybe you have children with them with the six of cups, because six of cups is children, or you've known somebody since childhood. Okay, somebody has been disrupting that, putting shit, doing shit to you, disrupting that. And I really feel like, Scorpio, you're being called in 2023 to go into that shit. Yeah, that's confirmation. You said you heard that screeching. Somebody has been distorting your mind or this is you. You're being called to go down in 2023 without these people, without this spell work. You need to get the fuck away from this cancer or whoever or Capricorn or whoever the fuck this is. Whoever the fuck this is, dog. Because somebody somebody has really, or you need to release this hate, this jealousy, this envy within you uh, regarding this person. What's the high priestess and the magician? Yeah, I knew it. The five of swords. Hate. Jealousy. Somebody hates that you're respected, that you're you're popular, that you're an occultist, that you're looked after, that you that people get advice from you, that you're paid very well, that you're a star, that you're successful, that you're celebrated. Somebody is just completely fucking mad about that. Yeah, the four of pentacles in the reverse, the, the, the lovers in the eight of swords, yeah, the strength, yeah, the nine of swords, somebody's worried that they can't, they can't, somebody knows that their spell work and they fuck shit ain't working on you. It's just not going to work. Or your, your shit ain't working on this person. What's the high priestess and the magician with the queen of swords? Somebody is, yeah, the star, Aquarius energy. Somebody's a star, a huge star. They're going to be a huge fucking star. Okay, if they're not yet, yeah, this is in this person's future. The three of wands is the future. Yeah, the Ten of Swords and the Five of Cups is over. Yeah, somebody, the Sun card could be a Leo, could be a Libra, a Pisces, or a, a, a Aries, Sagittarius, or somebody with these placements. Could be a Virgo. But I feel like somebody's a master mason. Somebody is a beast with this, or or, or um, a cultist, a master occultist with the hermit and the high priestess and the magician. Bitch, you ain't fucking with it. You pull him, somebody pull, is pulling all majors. They're pulling the temperance. The sun, the star, the high priestess, the magician, the, the justice, and the hermit. Somebody is a major deal. Just with these two cards, with the goddamn star and the sun card, somebody's going to be a huge star. Somebody else is mad about it or they're jealous or you need to release that shit if you are. Because it ain't, yeah, the five of swords because it ain't going to make a fucking difference. This person's still going to shine. It just don't matter. Yeah, the five of swords, four of cups, nine of pentacles in the high front. What's the five of swords? Yeah, yeah, the tower and the three of pentacles. Yeah, a lot of people in cahoots working you in a Capricorn or you in a Cancer or you in whoever the fuck this is. Yeah, the seven of cups and the three of swords that is trying to get yeah, the nine of wands. Yeah, that's trying to figure out a way to cause a breakup or to confuse something. Someone's confused because whatever this is that they're trying to do isn't working. Yes, yeah, backfiring. Seven of wands and the queen of cups. There's a water sign somewhere trying to block somebody's forward movement or keep somebody from having something. What's the three of swords or cause a breakup or you're in cahoots. Yeah, the three of cups in the reverse or to keep something from moving forward or a, a reconcil reconciliation from moving forward. Somebody's a fucking clown. A real live clown. You and all these people you watch with, bitch, if it's you. I don't give a fuck. This could be a family member, a sister with the three of cups, a cousin, a sister, a family member, or a friend you're in cahoots with. Y'all, all y'all bitches hoes. We got the four of pentacles in the reverse. It's over. Release it, let it go. Nothing yet a full card. Somebody's letting it go. They're releasing, they're done. You could try to stop them, block them. None of your shit has worked thus far, and it's definitely not moving forward in 2023. I feel like somebody's about to pay heavy. Yeah, it's not working. Four of Cups. It's just not going to work. Someone's confused. They're like, why, though? Yeah, you and this Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, this is a lose-lose. Two of Swords. This is a lose-lose situation. You and this queen of pentacles, a Capricorn in reverse doing wicked. That's somebody in the dark magic or do wicked shit. I feel like a Cancer, a Capricorn, a Scorpio, a Taurus, and some old bitches is in cahoots. Yeah, your family. You're in cahoots with your family or your family is in cahoots against you. But I'm getting somebody is way more powerful than whatever the fuck you're doing or who you're going to. It's in their DNA. Like somebody, this, this shit ain't going to work. It's just not. I feel like, yeah, the Ten of Wands, all this stress and doing this is, is for nothing. 
because it's just not going to work. Somebody is free. You're not going to possess them, control them. That there, There's not going to be a reconciliation or nothing. Somebody here is an evil fucking motherfucker. Yeah, the four of wands and the king of pentacles. Somebody is moved. What's the four of wands, king of pentacles? Yeah, the will of fortune. Yeah, somebody's fortune is to be a millionaire and a huge star. In the future, yep. This is, this is destined. With the will of fortune, this is somebody's birthright. Will of fortune and a the star. There's nothing you can do about it. Yeah, the nine of pentacles to be very, yeah. Yeah, to be very to be very independent, self-sufficient. Yeah, the eight of wands and the judgment. Somebody's calling. So whoever's jealous of it or want to compete or argue or fight, because there seems to be a lot of people jealous. Who are these jealous loser fucking bitches? Evil old bitter hoes, male or female. Y'all bitches is pathetic. We have the yeah. The devil, uh, yeah, bad built body, wide built ass, ugly, scrunched up in the face ass Capricorn. This is how the bitch look in the face. This is how they look at people. This is how you look at people or whatever. Yeah, and there's that cancer. Capricorn, cancer, Scorpio. That's in cahoots here. Three of pentacles working together. Yeah, it's over. The world card. Somebody is aware. It's over. The world is a cycle. It's complete. It's dead and it's done. Eight of cups. It is over. You're, th this person is free or you're not going to do this to this person ever. Yeah, the Empress, you're not going to do that to this person. The Empress in the Page of Wands, yeah, somebody is royal. Page of Wands is royalty. The, the Ten of Pentacles, so it's in their bloodline. Somebody's too powerful, man. You're fucking with the wrong one. Yeah, the Emperor, yeah. You're fucking with the wrong one. You and all these fucking clowns. All y'all bitches is clowns. I said it and I meant it. This person is going to get married. They're going to have life, especially if they're a Libra. They rule the planet of marriage, luxury, beauty. They're going to have all that. You can try to stop it, block it. It's not. I can promise you it's not. You already know that, though, because none of your shit has been working thus far, and it's not going to. You can go get every person in the fucking world, and it's not going to work, Period. You're going to be end up sick. This could result in a death. This could result in a whole bunch of shit. But it's not going to result in this. Instead of being a hater and a loser going against somebody, you should have tried be, befriending them or being a bad but, but people too busy, be too busy feeling old and played out and like a fucking loser because they are. So they want to attack other people's shit that they work for or somebody wants to do this or you're trying to you're trying to publicly humiliate somebody or or knock somebody off their shit. They're not. You can't publicly publicly humili humiliate this person. This person is loved and their fans and everybody else is 10 toes down with their motherfucking ass. Somebody is in their north node. They're doing what they're called to do and there's nothing you can do about it, bitch. Not a goddamn thing. You fucking loser. Because that's what the fuck this is. Or this is somebody else that's the loser that's doing this to you. You pick what side of the shit you want. Okay. Period. Yeah, the king of wands and the two of cups with the nine of swords. And the page of cups and the six of wands. And the seven of swords. Yeah, somebody's sneaky, a liar. This is just giving me some real sneaky ass vibes. Somebody may try to gift you something or whatever. I feel like somebody's trying to gift somebody something to trick them. It's not going to work. Somebody is a high priestess, a, a, a hermit, a, a fucking magician. Somebody knows what the fuck is up before you even try it. They know what the fuck you're going to try. They already know. What's the devil in the tower card and the three of pentacles? I feel like a whole bunch of people are going to fall here. A situation, a conglomerate, these people you in. Yeah, something backfired. Yep, the seven of wands. Something is going to backfire. A plan is backfiring or it's not happening. The hangman is the universe putting something on pause. Or you're trying to delay somebody's plans or forward movement. It's a no. It is a no. Seven of wands. Just Period. Or someone's going to block you. Yeah, you're trying to block somebody's love life or keep somebody bound or trapped or stuck to you or block somebody from being with someone else. Yeah, it's a, it's a no. The Ten of Swords, the Eight of Swords to the lovers is a love spell or a binding spell. But with the Ten of Swords, it's broken. It's backfiring. It's a no. Five of Cups is a disappointment. It's a no. Somebody in the Four of Pentacles in the reverse, that shows somebody is not meant to be bound to you, bitch. They never were and they never will. They have a new dick that they're riding that's very, 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 very good. Yeah, great sex, happy marriage, and long term. They're not going to fuck with you. You're, you're a fucking clown for even trying this because you have been. I see it right here, bitch. 
And it's never going to work, pussy ass nigga. And I'm saying it, it never worked then, and it's never gonna work, ho. So you could try to humiliate, whatever. You're the you're the hum, you're the humiliation, bitch. You're the loser. You're the bottom feeder in the fucking rap. That's you, bitch. It ain't this person, and you know that. That's why you're obsessed with trying to do work on them, block them on their body, on their beauty, on their motherfucking everything, bitch. And, and guess what? They 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 ancestors, guys. Their their deities. They. Uh, they shit ten toes down, ho. It won't never. Period, point blank. It won't never. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. You're trying to change somebody's work or change something that somebody does for work, bitch. It's not. It's a no. It's a hell no. Or this is somebody trying to keep you from somebody else. You could do spare work on their body, on their weight, on their breasts, on their skin, on their smile. None of that shit is going to work. Somebody's, all their shit is protected. It's protected. Okay, so those are your messages. Okay, I'm up out of here.